And the federal government has also relaxed total lockdown aids imposed on the federal capital territory, Lagos and Ogun states to curb the spread of COVID-19. In the new guidelines released to journalists by the National Coordinator for the Fight Against COVID-19, Dr. Sani Aliyu, during a press conference organized by the Presidential Task Force on COVID-19, supermarkets, food stores, pharmacies and markets are exempted from the lockdown but must operate under strict rules. I want to re-emphasize to the security agencies that there is a difference between a lockdown for election purposes and a lockdown for the purpose of controlling an epidemic. Um, there is a need for certain groups to be allowed to move around and I will appeal to the security agencies to please uh, um, cooperate and help us to make sure that um, the necessary um, instruments are in place and uh, people are also allowed um, in situations where we have made exemptions. As you are aware, the federal government has decided to impose social distancing measures and limit the spread of um, SARS coronavirus. In line with this, schools, organizations, and businesses in the federal capital territory, Lagos and Ogun State, closed effective from the 30th of March 2020 at 2300 hours for an initial period of two weeks. This guidance applies to these three states, but it is possible that state governments may apply other measures as they, see, as they deem fit. For the period of the lockdown, every person in these two states and the FCT will be confined to his or her place of residence and less strictly for the purpose of performing an essential service, obtaining an essential good or service, or seeking medical care. Borders linking the two states and FCT to the rest of the country will be shut during the period of the lockdown, except for the transport of persons on essential duty, transport of food, fuel, manufactured goods, or donated relief at items. Security agencies are please invited to note this. Mass gatherings is prohibited except for funeral services as guided by infection control and prevention regulations for which social distancing rules still apply and crowds are limited to not more than 20 persons. Movement between and within the two affected states and FCT is restricted except for workers involved in the delivery of authorized essential services, duties, food and goods. Retail shops and malls must be closed, except where essential goods are being sold. Shops and malls that are open for this reason must enforce social distancing and hygiene measures in line with issued guidelines. Any business or organizations providing essential goods and services must identify the staff who will perform these activities. Commuter services between cities and states including passenger services, bus services, e-hailing services, maritime and air passenger transport are suspended for the period of the lockdown in the affected states and FCT. However, limited transport services will be allowed for the movement of workers, services and goods in response to COVID-19 and for the purpose of seeking medical attention or the provision of essential services.